AI-powered drone swarms, already a reality in Ukraine. In Ukraine, drones aren't just piloted by humans anymore. They're starting to fly, think, and even strike on their own. One night, three unmanned aerial vehicles hit a Russian site in total darkness. No human picked the moment of attack. The drones did. This wasn't an experiment. It was swarm technology in real combat. Swarming means drones don't just fly solo. They act like a team, sharing data, dividing roles, and adjusting mid-mission on their own. Ukraine has taken this idea and made it routine on the battlefield. Fittingly, the leading system is called Swarmer. Its software decides who scouts, who strikes, and who cleans up. If one fails, another instantly takes over. You set the target and the drones do the rest, explained CEO Serhii Kuprienko. Swarmer's tech wasn't born as a weapon. It was first used in 2023 to lay mines. Today, it strikes Russian trenches, vehicles, and soldiers. One Ukrainian officer said his unit has already used it more than 100 times. Most missions involve three drones, sometimes up to eight. Tests prove the system can handle 25 at once. A common setup looks like this. One scout, two bombers. The scout finds the route. The bombers decide when to drop. Only three people are needed to run the mission, a planner, an operator, and a navigator. Without swarm software, nine people would be required. That's manpower Ukraine can't afford to waste against a much larger army. It's also harder for Russia to jam signals when drones communicate directly to each other. And Swarmer isn't stopping. The company now plans to test swarms of more than 100 drones. There are limits, of course. Drone-to-drone -drone links can overload networks. AI software adds costs, making mass production tougher. And yet, Ukraine still managed to build 1.5 million drones in 2023 alone. The ethics are also under scrutiny. The UN has warned about lethal autonomous weapons. US rules still require human authorization in the kill chain. Swarmer insists the same. Humans choose the target, the drones handle the rest. 